Sumner, Washington. A small town known for its community feeling and agriculture, Sumner was established in 1883 named after Senator Charles Sumner. This is also the place where 16 average high school students are about to begin the adventure of a lifetime. They've already been divided into two tribes and already they're beginning to form first impressions. They will be very baffled by my present, my personal presentation, especially how I talk and my phrasing will catch them very off guard. I'm from a different school than everyone, all the other contestants. Um, it might be a disadvantage because, you know, everyone's, they may not like know each other, but they've been around each other and they know how they act. But it also could be an advantage because I'm unpredictable in that way and no one will know what I'm going to do. I am a very competitive person. I can't lose to anybody, especially someone who I know I can beat. It is the ultimate challenge. 16 average high school students forced to work together to create a new society while battling the elements and themselves. People won't expect that, won't expect a lot from me, I feel like, because I'm a pageant queen or whatever. I think they're going to see me as a threat because I'm kind of athletic, so they want to get me out of the way. So I do think I will be targeted because I am in a relationship with someone who's on the show. They must learn to adapt or they'll be voted out. In the end, only one will remain to claim the title of sole survivor. Everyone's going down. 39 hours, 16 people, one survivor. Welcome to Survivor Washington, Sumner. <laughs> Alright, let's get some introductions going here. As you can see, you've already been divided into your two tribes. Uh, let's see, you in the purple, what's your name? I'm Eli Evers. And what do you do? I play baseball and tennis. Alright, let's go down the line, we'll just follow what Eli did. Okay, I'm Brooke Carla and I play water um, I feel like on day one, I'm just gonna lay low and not like make any like huge moves or anything like that because I feel like that'll just expose me as a player. I'm Chris Nimble, I play golf and track and field. I'm Celeste Jessup, I don't play sports. Well, I'm an actor, so hopefully that'll come into play at some point. No. I lying, poker face, that sort of stuff. I'm George Montano, I play football. I'm Jones, I play swim. Uh, so, other uh, contestants will probably think I'm a jerk or an asshole, but this is sarcastic, so you can probably get used to it. I'm Ethan Vincent, I play piano and cross country. I'm Casey Hobson, and I do pageants. I feel like they won't know that I know how to make fires or any of that. I don't know if we're going to make fires, but I have a lot more to me than just being the pretty girl or like doing my hair and stuff. My name is Hayden Hedenshner, I walk the most day. A week? A <laughs> week, yeah, gotta yeah. go. My name is Tyson Rainwater and I play baseball and football. I'm Isabel Emery and I play soccer. Um, I'm just gonna try to be nice to everyone and make a lot of friends and just have a good time. I'm Kayla Moore, I play basketball. I'm Maddie Barr, I sing at Um, I'm Emily James, I'm in leadership and I'm a wrestling manager. I'm Parker Reed and I play football. 
And I'm Joe Nigel Hoda, and I play basketball. I will be taking things seriously, but I think because of like my lighthearted demeanor, I think that they may not see me as completely serious all the time. Eric. What? How's the right end? What? The right end. Like on the thing? Yeah. It's cool, I guess. It's really slow. It's really slow. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Tyson, any first impressions you got? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> 60 hours went. You're going to get 39 hours of total game time with hours of sleep in between, of course. But these people are going to be with you for the rest of the next three days. Right here, right tribe. You guys look ready to go. Are you? Yeah. <laughs> you guys are in red. You are Columbia, named after the largest river in Washington State. And you guys. You guys are Rainier, named after the largest mountain in Washington State. Go ahead and open it up. You guys put your buffs on. Okay, we're Introduce we're your, each other to your tribe. Get each other your <laughs> brown. Yeah. yeah. This is my we're favorite color. Oh, I love this. Okay. Where do we even put this? I don't know. Like any one yeah. good song. Yeah. There you go. Do you want to see your little there's thing back? Why is there on your arm? There's a lot extra. There's a hole in the middle. Put it around your neck. Does this look good? Yeah, tie it. I'm going to Yeah, tie it. I'm going to tie it. Oh, you're right here. Right here. I think you can do it. You guys are already divided into your two tribes that are going to be battling each other for the next day and a half. Until you merge, these are the tribes you're going to be sticking with. We're going to get to our first vote right now. Here's what's going to happen. Each of you is going to go down the line and you're going to vote for a tribe leader. That tribe leader is going to make one of the most important decisions in the game starting now. I don't want any time to think about it. We're going to straight up and we're just going to go right for it. If you don't know the person's name, it's got to ask. We're going to start with you, Eli. Okay. I vote Kristen. Brooke. I vote Eli. Kristen. I vote Eli. Uh, I vote Celeste. Kristen. Cele I'm sorry, Celeste. I vote Kristen. George. Kristen. Ethan. I vote Eric. Yeah. <laughs> Eric. Andrew's brother. Yeah, Aaron's brother. <laughs> Aaron's brother. Casey. Um, Kristen. So who voted for Kristen? That's four, that's enough. Kristen, are you good with leading your tribe? Okay. Uh, Kristen was chosen team leader but I think she's gonna do a good job and lead us to some victories. All right, let's get over here. Joe, we'll start with you. Tyson. Parker. Tyson. Emily. Joe. Maddie. Joe. Kayla. Uh, Joe. Isabel. Joe. And Tyson. Joe. Okay. Joe. Hayden, there's no need to count your vote. It's already a majority. <laughs> I don't know what people are gonna think now. I feel like a lot of pressure's on me, but at the same time, I feel like they put a lot of trust in me, so I better fulfill it. Joe, so let's see our leaders. Joe and Kristen, why don't you guys step out in front of your tribe? The good news is, is both of you guys will make it to your hand. The bad news is, is you're picking somebody who's not going to make the walk. Do you have any questions about that? It means you're going to be selecting somebody that's not going to make the walk with your tribe. Wait, are you going to be out, like, totally? I can't answer that. Okay. <laughs> you have your your person. Go ahead and turn to me. <laughs> Got it. All right, Kristen, let's hear it. Sorry, but it's left. It's left. Right. Joe. Yeah. All right, right there. Come here, yourself. Yeah. All right, Celeste and Hayden, could you guys come up to me, please? There are new <laughs> Thoughts, you guys? Eh, yeah. kind of sucks. Things happen. Things happen. Right. Hayden, do you think you're going to get picked? No. Not at all? No, I'm sure. So. Then, no. Celeste, what about you? I kind of did. Really? Why is that? That just seems to happen, usually. <laughs> really? Okay, well, I did say you weren't making the walk with your tribe. You won't be walking with your tribe. You two are going to be driven to your camps. You'll wait for your tribes there. Thoughts? Hayden, you're laughing. I'm just laughing. You're just, yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop laughing. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Celeste? Uh, it's better than getting kicked out. <laughs> better than getting kicked out. Yeah, it's true. 
it is better than getting kicked out. However, you're missing very precious time with your truck. All right, so if we get the truck around here. <laughs> we are so not the trouble on there. All right, you two are going to board this truck right here. Go ahead and get in the back, the very back. The trunk. So it's like the first hour and they already voted someone out. Like thank God it wasn't me. Why left? Um Ethan! Yeah. Ethan's speaking up right away. <laughs> well Kristen, if you don't mind, I'll ask Ethan. Ethan, what do you mean by that? Uh, she just seemed like she didn't really have what it took to uh, you know work with us. I think uh, I think she made a good decision. I accept you as our leader. And this tribe, this tribe's shocked. <laughs> Can I hear uh, from Joe? What are you thinking? Uh, I definitely was hoping, since you like didn't specify if they were leaving, that they weren't going to leave because I felt terrible no matter what. But I picked him because I knew that he can take stuff a little lighter than other people, and that if it was like something different, that he wouldn't be as shocked. If that makes sense. Kayla, you look really shocked when Ethan brought up his comments. What was going through your head there? I don't know. I I like everyone. I don't. Feel like <laughs> I don't know. I think like teams should be united and So let me get this straight. You guys are ready to go back there, and you're gonna welcome Hayden with open arms. Yeah, absolutely. And over here, you guys are opposed to welcoming I'm Celeste. So sure, guys. I, don't know I guess I just heard. I don't even know her. Brooke, can I? Cool. Let's hear from you, Brooke. What do you think? What are you gonna do when you get back there? Celeste is gonna be angry. Oh, I'm gonna be nice to her. I mean, that's not. I can't really judge someone by their looks or right. anything like that. So. I, I thought I was getting like booted out right away, like an immediate eviction kind of thing. So this is definitely better than that. Um, yeah. Yeah, I don't, I don't know, you know. Take the hay out of your mouth. And no, no. See, that, that would be too easy. This no. is all getting cut. Oh, I know it is. I'm trying to, well, I, don't, you know, I don't care. You know, things happen. You know, you can't fight it. It's rock and roll, man. <laughs> it's, uh, Hayden John around Hayden Deschner, and uh, I was the first one to get voted out, but not like uh, you know the normal voting out. <laughs> oh, oops, sorry, my bad. Uh, vo normal voting out thing. I just got to ride back, but uh, yeah, yeah, I'm not mad. You know, it's fine. It's fine. You know, I don't care. You know, it's fine. All right, so you guys have a short walk ahead of you. You're going to be getting to your tribe soon enough. Um, you got one more thing. Each of you has a food cooler in the back of the truck. Columbia, yours is white. Rainier's, yours is blue. You're going to need to carry that with you as well. So, be on your way. I'll see you guys for the first immunity challenge of the season. Take the iPad. I'll do it. Take everything. You got it? Anybody want it? No? Oh, you could do okay, like one it. person oh, holding on one side up. and then another person. It's not even that heavy. Oh, okay. it's, it's full of organs, trust me. <laughs> Eric, are they yours? Yeah. That's my thought. Oh, yeah. I donated both my kidneys, so now I can't, like. Oh, yeah, that's <laughs> totally true. You have both my kidneys. I can feel all the filter out. Now I gotta carry your sushi. Damn it. Would you rather carry this? <laughs> okay. I'm gonna like, hug Hayden when I get there. I'm What's so everyone's bad. name? I'm Kayla. I'm Isabel. I'm Maddie. Kayla, Isabel, Maddie. What's your name, sir? Emily. It's day number one. Um, early in the morning. This is my first confession. Um, I really like my team. I think it's going really well. Um, it's going to be really hard voting people off. Ethan, of course, had to and say weakest link while she was still in your shot. Okay, I watched it. Dick. <laughs> <laughs> and that's what they did. And what they did is they took the weakest link that each team, yeah. and they had to choose it, and they had to vote like right there. And yeah. then they got a helicopter. Yeah, they got a helicopter. helicopter. And that's why I was like, everyone else, like, I don't know. Like, Kristen, I know what you're doing. I thought they were going to have him trade. When he said that, I can't answer that. I knew I was trying. If we are Hayden, you're amazing. I'm not sure this is enough food for three days. I know. <laughs> I, I feel like it's going to be open again. Of course, we've heard the cube. Come on, you know. Okay, I'm going to like fall. I want to relive spirit of summer. Come on. 
Blue team against the Blue team. I kind of wish my team had been Blue team because I watched that show Red versus Blue. Oh. So I thought I was getting evicted right away, but turns out I got to be driven to the beginning of the campsites, and now here I am before everybody else. And then what are your guys' names? <laughs> Tyson. And I'm Joe. Tyson, Joe. I'm Parker. Parker. Okay. What was the guy that? Hayden. 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 Yeah. I'm gonna go hug him when I get there. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody needs a big group hug now. No, I think that you're gonna have like the you opportunity have, like, to do something to either like help the tribe or like find an idol. Yeah, he'll yeah. probably oh, yeah, be me in the next round. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe we have to like. And then find he's just gonna be like, I vote you. Find a tent, and if he doesn't find it, we're screwed. I don't think. I don't think it's a. He seems really cool about it. Yeah. <laughs> That's why, because I thought you guys all look at your like, puppy eyes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I thought he looked at all. He lives in South Hill. He walks in the opening thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Somebody who I didn't know, then somebody I didn't know. Because then <laughs> I went like immediately make a moral out of me. Why? Why do you bring this? It's not in the world. I just want to make sure you beat Eric down. Break his morale. I don't even know where Eric is the really deep voiced one. The curly hair? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but beat he, him. He seems kind of like. Beat, beat his morale. Like a jerk. No, he's great. He's okay. one of my good friends. Just destroy his morale. Destroy him. Don't leave him. Well, I don't. I'm not supposed to be fraternizing with the enemy. It's, it's, it's okay. So while the idol itself is not hard to find, the people at camp are what you must mind. If you dig in the wrong area, you may get caught, so look for the place that isn't an unusual spot. Huh. So I guess I get to hunt for the idol. Works for me! <laughs> there was a note and it said, um, watch out, you can find the idol but it's hidden in an unusual spot. Or not in an unusual spot. And I don't know where the hell to look. I tried digging in some like dirt mounds and stuff, but I looked under the log at the campsite. I don't know what the hell to do. Okay. The heat of the location makes this place a treasure. Some may use it during their leisure. No need to look hard, just slow down your pace. Look for the piece that is far out of place. Right. Yeah, and then we can yeah, go we into the merge with like a, here. well, like, crazy oh, majority. Oh my god, it's good to like, like drug dealer trucks. Dude, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you know how many people make it to the Fury? Nope. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Is it like cool. the last... Because it's an odd number, right? I don't know. That so would make sense. Maybe it's like... Seven in the jury? Maybe it's like nine. Seven or nine? I guess that makes sense. No, it has to be up or odd. 
They had even ones in the last couple of seasons because they had three different finalists. So, based off of my team, I have a feeling that it's going to be divided, girls versus boys, at Tribal Council. So, I guess I'm going to have to start talking to the guys and get my social game going. Can we go? Can we go this way? Can we go pet Oh, dude, this is really good. Natural. Natural order. Dude, let's go frog hunting. Oh, it's actually a lot of food. Yeah, that's actually a is lot it? of food. Like yeah. muffins. Yeah. We're supposed to ration oh, that's so it off. Nice. It's like tortillas. We're going to make burritos, guys. We're going to have a fajita night. Oh, <laughs> you got it? No, never mind. You got it? Thank you. Like anyway, back to fajita night. Um, and I guess the new tribe leader. I don't know. <laughs> Seems kind of weird. I, uh, I didn't really expect it. And then I didn't expect even more the decision I had to make to quote unquote remove Hayden. I was hoping like to the very end that I would that he'd just come back, which he did. So I guess it all worked out. I still feel terrible about it, but you know what are you gonna do? Now we're here. How's it been, buddy? Good. You know, that right to camp. I was like, you know. Uh, for the most part, as far away from camp you can go with the car. Right. <laughs> <laughs> over there. Right, who wants to help set up the tent? Yeah. Yeah. Right. Right. Uh, right. uh, uh, we put our stuff like over there. Yeah. 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 I'm interested to see how this is going to go because there's groups of people that know each other and there's a few people that, uh, I don't know, that aren't really in a group or haven't, or aren't like local from here. So there might be some divisions or uh, separations, but as of right now, we're all doing pretty good together and I'm interested to see how this goes. I'm covering a bubble down, so right there. Put one like over here. Alright, alright. Oh, I'll do that for shit. <laughs> oh, nice. That guy. Yeah, anyway. So we have no. a chair, just kidding, there isn't I think, water. an empty bucket. How would you do that? Alright, let's tell some spooky stories. There's some cute art. Uh, yeah, cute. Um, I vote to we'll go right here instead. Yeah. Wait, no, but it's gonna be. This wait. is gonna be in the sun later today. So we, we just gotta well, put it. We don't have to put it up way. right now. We can just figure it out later. But, like back there is a good spot. What are we Super doing? So <laughs> I'm really good at setting up tents for the camp a lot, so I'll help. Okay. Okay. Oh my Let's god. Okay, if there's instructions, we gotta throw them out now. Is this a tar? What is it? Oh, this is a huge tent. I think that also can be one. No. I think that's not allowed. Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay, maybe like we're jump Ten, ten. Four, three to four people in this one. So probably boys tent, girls tent. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Oh, Dude, I've already started eating all the berries. They're There's like, in my eye. hey, you want Cheez Its? <laughs> yes. <laughs> this isn't a tent. This is like the bottom of it. Yes. Oh, oh wait. I see. Yeah. Oh. Oh, Why is this one so yeah. <laughs> I feel bad. Well, let's not put it on these sticker bushes. Let's move the... Yeah, move the... I don't know.
noticed that we have some strong players like Kristen. Kristen's really helping out at camp and she's taking charge, so. Ow. We also have like really smart people like Eli. I think Eli will help us out if we have any like puzzle challenges or anything like that. So overall, I think we have a well rounded today. So if the engine is over here, we should probably have it like facing this way. Yeah. Here, I think uh. that's it. So uh, we've, uh, we've just gotten into camp. We've set up one of the two tents. I think I've established a presence as uh, the alpha male in my tribe. So you know, I'm just uh, I'm just gonna wait till uh, the first games, and then hopefully, uh, hopefully I can get some people voted out. You know, do what I want. That'll be good. So yeah. Is this like a bench or something? Right here. I just got bit by a mosquito, guys. Ready? Okay. Yes. Day one, our first challenge is to put up a tent, and it's going okay. It is day one, and our team is pretty good, but it's hard, and we can't figure out how to work this tent. <laughs> Wabbits. Something wabbits. Dude, I saw a bunny earlier. Dude, did you like shoot it? No, it? I didn't. I just gotta get that protein, it. yo. Like a Go lift. Person. We're just like mindlessly walking wandering around. It's just sad. What? We're just like mindlessly wandering around our, our campsite. So? Oh, my okay, God. ATV. Let's go steal it. ATV? Yeah, over there. You can go for it. Let's do some statums, dude. Um, the bullet dude will look past us. Is it? You know what? Yes, throw it at them. So far, I'm liking my group. You know, they're all cool and funny. You know, I think we're going to go far because we're actually working as a team pretty well over there so far. And um, hopefully, we can make it really far in this. Find JQs and beat them up. <laughs> you're doing a slingshot right here. Oh, you got even bigger one right here. I giant slingshot. Chief George. Chief George. Leader of the Yeah now. <laughs> it's our new it's our new campsite. <laughs> ah. Alright, that's our new tree. Eli, are you kidding me? I mean, they're pretty cool. I mean it's fun to work with them. It's chill. What? Yeah, over here. Get get this thing up. Why? Because why not? Dude, no. That's stupid. Oh, I hurt yourself. Watch out. Shit, drop it. Ah! It's over, it's over. What are you even trying to do? Oh, no. no. Everyone's gone. Why not? So, we just kind of set up our tent. I think we've got a pretty good team so far. We've got a pretty good mix of athletic and intelligence, and I think we've got a good chance to win a lot of challenges. Yeah, I was I'm like, sure you are. Because I asked him, I was like, so is he getting off? He's like, I can't tell you that. I'm like, all right. I was like, all right. I was like, I need to pick someone who, who won't, like, like be super sad. You don't like, need to feel so bad about it. No, so bad. You, did you see how, like, I screamed. Yeah! <laughs> like, well, it's because I won't. I, <laughs> you had a sixth sense. You knew what was going to happen. Oh, I knew. That's why I kept looking at you. Where are the poles? Yeah, I'm here. So it's not in the book. So that you're person. not getting out in the front, right? That sounds like a fun way to wake up. It helps. Yeah. Wow. No, go straight forward. Like, uh, <laughs> think like you're making your bed. You're your cheat Yeah, I really work. We're kind of coming together very good. And I was surprised by that. Because some of the people kind of look like they want to be independent. But they turned out really good part of the team. Wait, there's two. I really like my team, and I don't know. We had good teamwork setting the tents up. That was awesome. And I feel like I'm doing pretty good so far. I feel like people like me so far, even though I'm the only one from Bonnie Lake. 
Lock it in there. <laughs> what? Oh, no. so oh, yeah. This is gonna be okay. our three hours before okay. the challenge. This goes like that, and that one, yeah. the other one. Goes like that. Yeah. Uh, I like it. I like it. Yeah, you're just supervising. I know. John would be. I was happy. like, I was like, everybody like started took John up stuff. John would be. Ow. You can't get this down. Yeah, I miss. What are these? Yeah. I'm gonna break the stake. I feel Joe, that too. How did too. you get this in here? Yeah. That, just get it as much as I don't you want can. Oh dang! Snap, crackle, pop. So far, our team seems really cool. We just set up tents and <laughs> seems cool. Oh, it's all moldy. Yeah. yeah. Team leader. <laughs> Gross. They're cheering Things over there. Things you should know. Do not leave your tent they set up in the sun longer than... Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Deal with it. You know, the tribe's pretty... Uh, we're, a, we're a close knit group of people. I think uh, we have a lot of good qualities, uh, you know, total. I think it shouldn't be too hard to, uh, to you know, dominate the other tribe. It's, I've had peanut butter, jelly, crackers, bread. And it's pepperoni. Cheese. Yeah. So we're set. We're set. Yeah. We're set. So this is how we're going to do it since we don't know the time. Sun reaches top. That's noon. Yeah. So we're going to oh. eat that. I can show, okay, so my dad's in the Coast Guard, so oh, he yeah. taught me this like, ship thing. So, you take your fist, so like, if you're a girl, your fist, like, the size of it, when you like match it up to the sun, is like approximately, um, like an hour and a half, and a guy, it's like an hour. So if you like, put your fist up to the sun, and like, rest the top of it right on, under it, and then you like, go like this, down to the horizon line, then it shows you like, how much time is left of daylight. That is so cool. Well, it, it'll go opposite, right? Day one's been good so far. Um, all the walking and the building the tents has kind of brought people together. We're all getting comfortable, not really in our shells anymore. Hey, we have silverware. Oh my gosh, nice. They plug. <laughs> Muffins, cereal, granola bars, loaf of bread. Oh, this is. I don't know if this is. It's so hot. It's already hot in there. Nope. Oh. <laughs> I can open it. Oh, where's my uh, oh. Read it out loud. Hey, we got a little riddle here. Hey, the, heat of lo the heat of the location makes this place a treasure. Some may use it during their leisure. No need to look hard, just slow down your pace. Look for the piece that is far out of place. What is it? Is that for an idol? I think it is. Wait, what? Something far, yeah, so like it's like hot. <laughs> yeah, if you're trying to search for the hidden immunity idol, make sure to ask one of your camera crew for a personal camera. <laughs> well, wait, this challenge? is for one person, and we're all... <laughs> when we were opening up our um, ice chest, there was a hint for the immunity idol, but we were all reading it together. Okay. Wait, what's it? It's for the immunity idol. <laughs> the heat of the place makes this place a treasure. So. Okay, the heat of the location makes this place a treasure. Some may use it during their leisure. No need to look. No need to look hard. Just slow down your pace. Look for the piece that is far out of place. Who's going? <laughs> is it the bucket? Uh, no, it's not the bucket. What time is it? It's not even noon yet. So, everyone knows the clue. Everyone's off scattered looking for it right now. Um, not sure who has the clue right now, so I'm kind of just going off of memory. I don't think I'm going to find it. Aiden! <laughs> That's the iPad right there. Alright, hold it. Oh, yeah. <laughs>
Oh, is that like a truck? It's like a truck. Cool. I uh, saw the clue, I knew about it before you and all the others. And I tried looking for it and I just couldn't find it. No, I think Isabel just started. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Let's go swimming. Alright, you guys want to like meet up now, I guess? Yeah. Alright, let's go. Watch out, throwing right there. Strategy? I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, it seems like um, Tyson, I can't remember the other guy's name, and Joe, they are all together as being like a pack, and then everyone else is kind of just fending for themselves. Basically, Parker and I started talking about the clues and about what made sense. And so we started checking a few places around camp, and then uh, Tyson walked off, and so Parker and I followed him. They split off to the right, and I thought, thought I saw a place that would fit the description. It was a tree. I walked under, looked around. And I thought nothing was there. At the very last second, I saw between cracks a little cloth, and then after I took that out, I knew what it was. And so I immediately came out and told Parker and Tyson. We debated what to do. Okay, what is it? No, I'm opening that. Hey, Tyson! Tyson, get over here. I think this is it. That's gotta be it. No freaking way! Oh, this, oh, it's under the tree where he's in. Oh my freaking! He followed me and I was like, huh? "What is it? Is oh. it like a feather on here?" It's like, like open the milk or I'll open the milk. There you go. It's a rabbit. Let me take this out. <laughs> it's a lucky rabbit. Yeah. All right. Congratulations! You found the hidden immunity idol. The idol will keep you safe at the tribal council as long as it is played. It is up to you whether you want to tell the others you have found the item or keep it a secret. The item must be played after voting, but before Hunter reads the votes. Hunter will ask if anybody wants to play an idol, and at that moment you may play it if you feel you need to. You may give the idol to someone else or play it in their name at the tribal council. The idol can be played once up until the final four. So do I we freaking knew I should have went over there with Do you. we tell them or do oh we keep it? Oh my god, I kind of hit me off. <laughs> what? Do we tell them? Keep it. I'll tell them, but I'll keep it. We'll hold on to it and yeah, we'll decide no, later when it's needed. Let them look for like a day. <laughs> no, don't finish his distress. Yeah, no, there's no reason. There's that. no reason to, though. I'll just tell them, but I'll keep it. It's fine. I'll keep it really close to me. Just keep it in there. And I'll pocket. save you guys. Okay, okay, so we don't even need this anymore. Yeah, I'll save I'll you guys if you, if you need to. I'll save it. <laughs> and likewise for you guys. I just walked up and said, guess what we found? Yeah. Guess what we found? Where'd you find it? Yep. I found it over behind the tree. Where was it It depends, honestly. I'm keeping it right now safe, for my, uh, both for myself and for the tribe. So I was like, I'm just going to kind of do it slowly and sneak out sometimes here and there and look for it. Couldn't find it, and then they found it when they went out. In the tree. What? In the tree? Yeah, oh, I, I looked so around. Funny. I looked around and I was like, wait. Okay, I was like, I w walked so in, and I looked around and I was like, okay, shade. So I went in the tree, like, brushed everything aside, and I, I was about to leave, and I looked straight tree? ahead. Yeah, I think it is. So is it your rabbit's foot? Yeah. And so then I looked straight ahead and it's I like saw the thing. tree. Yeah. Is it is that a okay. Congratulations, like a you have found the hidden immunity idol. This idol will keep you safe at tribal well, council. We all know. Our group is so like open, which I think is kind of strange. Like we're not strategizing at all. And like, what's that kid's name? Like the leader, like Joe or something. He like found the immunity idol and he like showed everyone. And I'm not really sure what he's going to do with that. So... 
I don't know, he kind of like seems like a threat right now. You want to tell others you have found the idol? <laughs> well, <laughs> we thought it, it was just better to tell everybody. The idol must yeah. be played after voting, but before Hunter reads the votes. I didn't expect it to just be in a random tree somewhere, you know? Well, so everyone you knows it about it. Stick it. Uh, oh, no, you said it has a necklace. Hey, it doesn't fit you might want to hide it from another <laughs> No, they can't take. They can't take it. They, well, they have their own idol. They have their own oh, idol. Okay. I don't think that's how a hidden immunity idol is supposed to work. Yeah. So as long as we don't lose, we won't need to use it. Yeah. But, but what happens? Yeah, yeah. What if we, if we do? So if yeah. We what lose, if we lose? Then... What? It seemed for a little bit like Tyson and Parker and uh, Joe formed an alliance when they went off and were looking for um, the immunity. But they found it and they brought it back to us and showed us. So, I mean, which is interesting. Interesting strategy. I don't really know what's going on here with our immunity. I don't believe in Joe. Uh, you know, it isn't hard. Like I said, I don't feel... He wants to use it for the group. If anyone, next person gets voted out, he wants to try to hand it to them. Somebody's going to end up getting voted, but then we should probably give... The idol to whoever's voted. But then at the same it's time... It's really up to him. Somebody has to get voted off. That's the thing. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. if we save to. someone that we think is going to get voted off, then someone who wouldn't have been is going to get voted off. I'm just gonna wrap it around my wrist. So we should just hold on to it for now and wait. What if we until all the game. Let's thing. just not lose the challenge. That's a good idea. idea. But either way, the next challenge, at some point, we have to use it. At some point, we have to use it. Someone has if we to lose, go. yeah. We'll figure it out. For now, well, we have it. Right? Yeah, it's his. Okay. To hold on. And he can choose to he save someone or not to. I don't want to get my life rest in Him as the leader though, I'm pretty sure he would use this for someone else because he I'm also not too worried about getting kicked off right now. I think we've built good friendships and we'll just see what happens after this first challenge. I don't think anybody is really playing Survivor right now. I think they're just trying to keep the team together for as long as possible, even though we do have to get rid of people eventually. Obviously, like, I, I want what's best for the whole group, and I think what's best for the whole group right, right now that we need to focus on is winning. And after we either win or lose, if we lose, then we'll, we'll, I'll have to think about what we're going to do from there. We definitely need, I hate to say, we definitely need the most gifted individuals left in the tribe, if that makes sense still haven't found the idol but our first challenge is in like 15 minutes so hopefully I can find it before things start to happen. We'll see. Tyson and Joe just kind of walked over and showed up to our camp and just kind of showed us that they found their hidden immunity idol already and now our whole team is just kind of trying to find it. I'm not entirely sure if they know how the hidden immunity idol works yet because they're like all working together to find it but I mean I guess if we're working as a team that's something good so far. Hopefully we not, won't need it today. I assume we're like watching Survivor because he's never seen it. Grab your stick, Eric. Can you take oh. a water bottle? Oh, we'll throw it oh. Up, Get out of here, Tyson! What are you guys doing? Tyson, get oh. out of here! <laughs> <laughs> we're not! Get out of here! So what happens if like someone gets voted off? You're wrong. The next person they goes? They can't be voted off. Then it's gone. Yeah. Like, you, there's no you play, so, so let's game. say Joe, they or lose they the next could challenge. Put another one in Joe, it. um, could... He has to show it if he wants to be a mute. Oh, whoa. If he doesn't, then... Attack. Like, if, he, if they're at Tribal Council and he doesn't, like, show it, then he can't use it. But if they're at Tribal Council and he shows it before they vote, then decide. they can't vote. Is Joe the one that actually found it? I think so. Then well, what if... Hasn't, but so. then you can only use it... Get out of here, kid! He's kind of dumb for revealing that to his team. So you only use it when you vote. Give me a rock, give me a rock, give me a rock. If you, like, suspect... Use the log. I know, I don't know why I do that. He's like a... I wouldn't even... Oh, wait, I don't wait, think he's you guys, but I wouldn't really even oh, wait, want to show it off my own team. Yeah, no, yeah exactly. Like, yeah, well, it's kind of personal. Part of the yeah. I, you, like, uh, the yeah. idea is, if you show it to the other team, it doesn't really matter. Yeah. If you show and he's it to the leader. Team, then it matters. Yeah. So he's pretty much safe right now, like, as a leader. Like, he yeah, should no wait a while gonna... until later in the game, people are going to start going against Once him. No one's... Right now, we're pretty much all together. Um, we don't want to lose any challenges, because it's going to be hard to vote people off, because we're all pretty, like, well... Players, I think. We're gonna target yeah. the leader. Gonna yeah. Oh yeah, when you merge, and then if nobody then you don't know, have a leader. Yeah. They said that you can't just vote out a leader. I think mm. no one's gonna try to come after me until the merge when I don't have a team anymore. Go away!
I think he's trying to throw things better than us, but he's not. I'm about to throw this water bottle at Tyson's face because I'm allowed to. Because I'm allowed to. Thanks, but no thanks. You brought me flowers? Yeah. Go rock at them. They're weed flowers. Yeah, rock. You never even brought me flowers in real life, asshole. Oh! Truth comes out. Let's get in here. I'm good. Columbia, welcome. Rainier, welcome. Alright, you guys ready to get your first immunity challenge? Yeah. Absolutely. Alright. Most important thing in this game is immunity. You have immunity, you're safe from the vote. You cannot be voted off. As long as you have immunity, you will still be in this game. For the next day and a half, immunity. This is what you're going to be playing for. Go ahead and get a good, nice feel of this. <laughs> you're gonna be, okay. Okay, nice feel. You're gonna be wanting this. Ooh. Ooh. Handmade. Nice. <laughs> I'm already irking for it. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh yes. <laughs> yeah, it's good luck. luck. Good luck. Good luck. Yeah. Everyone touch it. You didn't touch it. No, you didn't touch it. Alright. Sorry, I've never touched him a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get a quick update. How are you guys doing? Kristen, your tribe leader. What's your tribe like? We are having a lot of fun. Yeah. We're getting to know Eric very well. Getting <laughs> <laughs> to know Eric very well. Columbia. Joe? Yeah, you're fantastic. fantastic. You're fantastic. Yeah. We already we were already like way ahead. I what do you like, got on your wrist there? Oh, this is this is the immunity idol. Uh, you know, just the sign now. <laughs> we just found it. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. So Not you're showing deal. Rainier over here that you found the idol. Oh yeah, no, I showed him like way long ago. I I, I cheated. <laughs> So no. you're Eric, you're aware that Joe has one of those powerful items in the entire game. Yeah, I do now. <laughs> Eric, he showed it to you. He showed it to me personally. I just heard about it. Eli, what's your reaction to this? I don't know. I feel like we have to find ours now. Yeah, we got I don't really know how I feel about it. I mean he's wearing it on his wrist, just like he owns the place, and I feel like that's not exactly the best strategy to have at this point in the game. I feel like he should have hid it from some people in his tribe. We want both camps. Yeah, so that's what's called being behind. Yeah. I feel like they should have just kept it hidden. <laughs> Yeah, you yeah, guys should have kept well, it hidden. I feel like, I feel like they're going to need yeah, it for, for their, for their yeah. Yeah. All right. later. I think we'll see how that plays out later on. For now, you're going to be playing for immunity today. You need this. You do not want to be first person voted out. You guys ready to get to today's challenge? Yeah. yeah. All right. For today's challenge, we have a nice little obstacle course set up. Survivors ready? Go! Yeah. Yeah. Fucking steadier. Oh dear. 
Columbia. Yeah. It's tied. <laughs> Put the immunity. Best two out of three. <laughs> I think I won. So I like what Columbia? Stay from the vote. Yeah. 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 Yes. Rainier? Can't say the same for you. So you guys are tribal council. Somebody's going to be the first person voted out of this game. You guys can head back to camp. Rainier, I'll see you at tribal council. Where is that? I got it. We have immunities, so that's great. Just won the first challenge, got the immunity idol. idol. Feels really good, kicking their butt. We just won our first challenge, which was awesome, doing the like, we had to like, get water in a bucket and transport it, but there were holes in the bucket. It's pretty stinking awesome. Oh yeah, I'm happy, I mean, I'm happy that I'm, uh, our team's winning everything. I'm very competitive about this kind of thing, so yeah, now I'm all happy for that. The immunity challenge went really well. I feel like our whole group is kind of, like, like together and they like work well together. My feet got soaked. I only brought one pair of shoes, so that's fun, but you know. As you can tell our team's pretty excited about our win. They're making a bunch of music in the background. Um, but yeah. I think it's going to be interesting who gets voted off the other team, and we just did, we really pulled together better than I thought of, that we would. And I'm feeling great. We just won uh, our first challenge, so we're safe from uh, elimination. Uh, I'm really happy about it because now I don't have to lose any of my teammates because I'm really, really happy with my team. Eric's so dumb. Friggin' stupid. Dude, we got him. There's like no chance. Like, honestly. See, see, his whole team hates him. <laughs> And he, he's, he's actually one of the athletic ones, too. So he that he's the most athletic of that team, and that's a, something, because he's not very athletic. No, but in the end, we need to be friendly with them, because if it comes down to it and we merge, we still got to have friends over there. Yeah, I don't care. I'll throw hands right now. We're not going to merge. We're just going to be our own club. Yeah, I'll freaking hit him on the head with that. Call them. Call all of them. I'm not talking to them too for the rest of the weekend. We did kind of talk some smack about the other team, so I hope they're not like pissed about that. And when we merge, if I'm still here, like, I don't know if they're gonna like hold that against us. Confession. Hey. 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 We're obviously bonding a lot. Yeah. Feels it's good. A family. <laughs> yeah. And that's all. And we love each other. We yep. do. Yeah, we do. And we really care about each other. <laughs> <laughs> This is fun. Everyone went out and found sticks. Yeah. Oh, we're supposed the to guys find did. sticks? No. Well, the guys did. <laughs> Only real, real men. I'm going to go find a stick after this. You heard it here first. Look at this. Your face is all Team Columbia. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. We lost our first challenge. Um, it's kind of... Hoping for the opposite, but yeah. The awesome was bullshit. Everything about it was dumb. They screwed us out of a win, and I'm not really mad, but I'm pretty mad. We lost, which is not okay. So we have to vote someone off, which is going to be hard, but we think we know who we're going to do. So, um, yeah, whatever happens, happens. And I feel like we personally should have won that. I mean, I feel like our team athletically was better than what we did and what we've got to do as this immunity or this travel council is we've got to make our team stronger physically. Our team did really good. It was close. Um, everyone worked really hard, um, but I did hear comments after the challenge that were like, we need to get rid of the weakest link tonight. And I'm pretty sure that's, I don't know who that is going to be. Um, I know I worked my hardest, even though I'm not the most athletic. <laughs> um, I've been uh, talking to some of my stronger team members, and uh, I think we're starting to get an idea of who we are going to eliminate. Looking back at the competition, it seems like we have some specific players that we need to vote out. But I heard weak link. 
the person that they were thinking about voting off, they were calling them the weak link. And they were saying how we'd be a stronger, better team without them. But yeah. Our team hasn't really formed any alliances so far that I know of. I think me, Kristen, and Brooke are pretty good. And um, there's a couple of the guys. I don't know how that's going to fold out because all of us are pretty close. Besides Celeste because she walked by herself. <laughs> Tell a story. Funny story. Come on. Um, I don't have any. You're like, funny story. I don't like I don't have any good stories. Here, I think I got one. Dude, okay. I'm going to see it. Let's see All right, so when I was younger, me and my parents, we all lived in California. That's where I lived. Yeah. And you know, we... So, and my first words were, you're stupid. <laughs> first words. And so I'd tell everyone that. There was this old lady on the elevator. She's like, oh, he's so cute. And I'm just like, you're stupid. <laughs> you're stupid. <laughs> <laughs> first words, bitch. Um, he's like, bitch. <laughs> I probably feel close to Eric. He's a really, uh, he's a cool guy. He's pretty funny. And uh, George, he's, you know, one of my good friends. So, but potentially, yeah, I see myself going to the end with, uh, with both of those guys, yeah. yeah. He's got short brown hair and white shirt on. I feel like he hasn't really socialized much, and he's not trying to play up his social game. He like he kind of, kind of seems like he's outside the group, you know. And so I just feel like if he's not going to be communicative, then he shouldn't be a part of a team that needs to work together. Celeste so needs to pick it up, you know. She's uh, I uh, haven't totally given up my hope, but uh, you know she needs to step up her game. We're trying to figure out who we're going to vote off. Mm -hmm. So, Ethan's fast, but he's not strong. No, he's not. Eric's strong, and he's goofy, but I don't really see him... I don't see him... I don't, I don't see him as a winner, you know? Like, I don't see him being the like last Like, actually one. making yeah. any game moves or anything exactly. like that. I don't think he's got the mental strategy down. I don't know about George. I mean, I feel like... George is really he's quiet. quiet, but yeah, he's, he's definitely... He's definitely good for something, so... Yeah, I feel like he's like stronger over Ethan. Yeah, so I, I think. think we should go with Ethan. Yeah, and mm -hmm. yeah. Ethan and Casey. Let's do like kind of like make Casey crazy. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, we're not gonna make anyone feel excluded because then it's obvious. Yeah, especially Eric found a slingshot. He just doesn't have the sling. You see, he's got that. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> Eric found a slingshot. What? Yeah, I did. Yeah. We're looking for the idol. Yeah. We were like, we, we were talking about it and yeah. we were like, why would she keep the note? Yeah, if there's a clue, why would she keep it? If she even found it. I don't know. Like, why wouldn't she want to leave it out so that everyone's mm -hmm. like, oh, looking for it and then she pretends to look for it too. You know what I mean? So you're the only individual person that she actually talked to. I was the only one that she tried to. to form an alliance with. So I went to try and form an alliance with Kristen, our uh, tribe leader, and she's already got a couple. I don't personally think that at this particular council I'm going to be much of a target. At this point we're trying to keep like physical and like get our team as challenged ready as possible. So she can go tell them that I have something that I was offering her, and now I am just totally screwed. <sighs> we'll see. I feel like someone here has it, but they're not telling I don't them. have it. I, I, I don't know. What? I, it makes no sense because that doesn't yeah, mean anything. Yeah, what the hell? Well, no, I don't have it. I swear. No, because if you have it I and you're confident it. that you're not going to be voted out, then when you feel like you're going to slip up, then you bring it there. I honestly don't have it. No, I I don't even know what it looks like to be honest. It looks like, it looks like a rabbit's foot. Is it? Yeah, it's a rabbit's foot. And you know that for sure. I saw I saw theirs. Is yeah, but that like doesn't mean that ours is like true. That? I feel like ours. No, is normally they're smaller. the same though. I feel like ours is brown, <laughs> and we're gonna have. A like brown a it's tan. brown, it's, yeah, a, it's, it's a bean, brown. it's in the bushes it's somewhere. It's brown and then half green so that when it's touching the ground, it's, you can't oh, see no. it. When it's in the trees, you can't uh, see it. Do you guys want elastic? Oh my god. No. What a about ponytail? The... Oh, I don't have my ponytail. Basically, everyone that I've talked to so far has agreed that Celeste isn't as strong as the other competitors, which I feel really bad voting her out because she's really nice and we've only had one competition. You gotta do what you gotta do to win. I feel like she was the one chosen to like take the separate walk by herself, so I feel like she's gonna be the one to get voted out first because it's easier because she's already been like chosen, so it's like not new. So yeah. Everyone seems like a strong player to me, so I don't know. Like, I most likely will like someone who probably isn't gonna get a bunch of votes 
or whatever vote for them because they're already going to vote off someone and I wouldn't really feel too good about that. But I mean, if I have to vote someone off, I will, but like, yeah. I still haven't found the idol, but I'm starting to wonder if somebody else has because uh, Columbia already found theirs and they're flaunting it like a bunch of jerks. But if it's that easy to find, someone must have found it by now. <laughs> yep. Want to be like, like um, yeah, can I go to the bathroom, please? Like, yeah, sure. Like, yeah. So then just remain standing while everybody's five seats are just Just stand in front of the seat. Behind each of you is a torch. Go ahead and grab a torch, approach me, put the torch in the flame, and get fire. Okay. Yeah. This is the ritual of Tribal Council. We do this because in this game, fire represents your life. As long as you have fire, you're still in the game. Once your fire is gone, so are you and your chance at winning this game. Do we hold it? Go ahead and put it back in place. Come on. Good job, guys. This is sweet. This is sweet. I'm going to lose. Okay, and you can have a seat. It's okay. You can get your feet. Well, this is Tribal Council. This is not a place you necessarily want to be. Tonight, someone's going to be the first person to vote it out. But before that, I would like to give everybody a chance to kind of speak their mind and start maybe a discussion or two that we can really get rolling on so everybody can get what they want to say out there. Eric, let's start with you. Okay. And I'm just wondering, uh, how are you doing with the tribe? What do you think of the tribe? They're all pretty cool. I don't really mind them. I mean, none of them, none of them are bad. Is everybody, like, confident in thinking this tribe is unified? We're thinking this is a good tribe, friendly tribe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Casey, what about you? What, where's what's your position been in the last hours with this tribe? Um, I don't know. We've all been like healthy now and all pulling our own weight and doing everything and just like getting along. So I feel like I've just been equal with everyone. I definitely think we need to address something, and that was the uh, the tent, setting up the tent early on. <laughs> <laughs> there were no instructions. He said us up to lose. You should have told us. George, what was that like in terms of team bonding? Um, I feel that it really showed like when people were help, like when like so there was a situation with a tent on one side, like others would go help that person and move on from there and support each other. So it was like a balance. Okay, let's talk about the challenge. Brooke, anything you could have done better that would have helped your tribe out more? Um, I feel like as a team, we should have uh, communicated better with like who's in which position. So I feel like that would have helped out a lot more because some people have more strengths than other people do in different aspects. Do you believe you were in the right position? Not necessarily. What do you mean by that? Um, I feel like I should have been in a position where I actually had to move the bucket more because I feel like I'm more of a fast person. Um, would you blame that maybe on yourself or would you say that maybe if you guys should have talked more as a tribe? I feel like we just didn't communicate well as a tribe. You think, would you agree with that? Yeah, I'd say uh, if we had taken a little time to talk it out, then we would have done a lot better. But Celeste, what I don't get is you guys say that when you're building the tent, of course you're having some troubles, but you're working well as a team. So where is that lack in teamwork? Where is it lacking? What's What needs to be fixed? Because it seems like you guys are bonded, you guys are, are together well enough, but it just doesn't seem like you're being able to accomplish anything. I guess we just need like better communication skills because we're, we're communicating in the fact that we're like sitting around and talking and laughing together, but we're not sitting around and strategizing. Kristen, would you agree with that strategizing is probably more important for your team? I think strategizing is important, but I feel like it's hard to strategize when we don't know what we're up against. I feel like maybe um, sharing our strengths and weaknesses would benefit us a little bit more than strategizing, just because 
we can't plan for the future if we don't know what it holds. Right, so Eli, let's talk about strategy. There is strategy and challenges, but then there's strategy around camp. Yeah. Have you been seeing a lot of strategy around camp? Not necessarily. We haven't exactly had that much time to form very many alliances that I've seen. And I feel like we've been more focusing on like getting the tents up and eating food and just having a good time so far. So it hasn't gotten to that serious of a point in the game yet, I don't think. Um, sorry. Uh, so, but when you look at Survivor and you look at the stuff that goes on in Survivor, wouldn't you agree that every move you make eventually has to be strategic at some point? That's true. Mm -hmm. And, of course, we've talked about, say, uh, your group dynamic. And I know that there are, you guys have been telling stories and, you know, having fun and stuff. But really, when you look at that, and you're looking at that your tribe is bonding so much, you realize that whether or not one vote may be easy or something like in any order whatsoever, that eventually you guys are going to start have, having turned on each other because there's going to be a final two, and out of the final two, only one's going to win. So that being said, wouldn't strategy necessarily, or wouldn't strategy be present from the very beginning yeah it's true i think we've got like i think overall we're just hanging more together there hasn't been as many opportunities to break off individually with people to form alliances yet but i feel like as we get further in this game we'll have more opportunities to break off with people and form our comprehensive game plan let's talk about the opening twist kristen you're selected as tribe leader and you picked celeste to be uh to not make the walk with your tribe um celeste you have any anger towards Christian or any hard feelings? Not really. At, at first I thought it was um, going to be like an immediate eviction, but after I found out that I was still going to be here, it was it was comforting to hear that instead. So, no, I don't really hold any grudges on her right now. And Kristen, have you two bonded at all and strengthened your relationship maybe from the point of, of that moment? Well, I told her why I did that, so I feel like that kind of Put the bridge back together a little bit it's not stable enough yet but it's getting there okay there's something else that is very important we need to talk about and that is columbia casey do you feel like is if columbia is a stronger tribe than you guys or do you just feel as if they got the advantage last challenge i think they just got the advantage i think we're a really good team and our bonding is actually going to help us in the future because we're going to become more of a team and we support each other, and that will help us not go to more eliminations. So I think they aren't stronger than us. And we won first, so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> George, let's talk about the immunity idol. Joe has it. He's made it very clear. <laughs> Everybody knows that Joe has the immunity idol. And uh, let's say five of you guys make the merge. Let's say you make the merge, George. How do you approach Joe knowing that he has the immunity idol? Um, same as I would with anyone, I guess, because, I mean, with a little caution, of course, because he has the immunity idol now, but if he slips up, like, he might have to use it, then he's going to, then if he, slip, he has future slip up, slip ups, then yeah, then he's going to be easier to vote out, but I'm not saying I would vote Right, okay, so, all eight of you cannot eventually meet up with Joe and figure out how the story is going to go from there. Seven of you do have a chance. One of you guys is going home tonight. One of you will be the first person to vote it off. Here's what you're going to do. Right behind me is the voting station. You're going to walk up. You're going to attach the pen, which is attached to, uh, or detach the pen, which is attached to two bone rib cage, or spines from a, a deer. Um, you're going to take the cap off, and you're going to write a name down. The iPad's going to be on. I want you to take the vote. I want you to say the reason you're voting for that person. It is not to be allowed to be quiet. You're going to fold the vote, and you're going to put it in the box right next to it. Does anybody have any questions? All right. Wait, what did I write with? Oh, it's right here. I need everyone's name. I'll be giving you your name. Okay. All right.
I don't. Oh, well, I, I. Oh. That's, that's what he said. I feel like she hasn't really been pulling her weight around camp. For Eric, he's rude, he's annoying, he's made a ton of offensive jokes. I can't handle that for a long time. If anyone has a good community idol and want to play it, now would be the time to. Oh, here we go, Eric. No. <laughs> oh, just kidding. Okay, That's cool. once the votes are read, the decision is final. The person voted out will be asked to leave the tribal council area immediately. Votes. First vote. Eric. Who did that? <laughs> Celeste. <laughs> thing is clear tonight. Number one, first impressions last. Number two, this tribe's going to get really divided in the next coming hours. Grab your stuff, head back to camp, we'll see you at the next community challenge. I don't think they're going to be finding that anytime soon. <laughs> 